You are my one more chance I never thought I'd find You are that one moment I've always known in my mind No one will ever touch me more I've always learned to Dun, dun, dun. I always save the best of me. I, I know. I hope I save the best of me for you. No, I'm sorry. That's such a good. That is such a good song. Um. Anyways, what's good, everyone? What is good? Welcome back to the channel with your children, of course, Mac. Hope you all are having a great day today on this beautiful Sunday. I'm having a swell day. I'm having a really good, like, week, actually. Actually, no. Saturday, no, bad, bad. Thursday sucked. Friday was good. Saturday was even better. So, yeah, I'm actually having a decent week. Anyways, but, uh, yeah, how are y'all doing? Hope you're doing great. Nope, that's not, my, that's not how it goes. It's what's good, everyone. What is good? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're back with another Sims 4 speed build. Today's speed build we are making. I don't know what she would call it, but, yeah, I'm making this house. It was actually supposed to be an interior, but I'm switching it up. I have been really slacking, and I think the reason being is I haven't really been on myself to upload these to the gallery, which I will be doing today. Um, so what I'm going to try to do now is I'm going to try to do an, um, an exterior, an interior, or exterior, exterior, interior, interior. I'm, try I'm trying to, like, even them out because I want to do the exterior, the, the exterior, the interiors for the exteriors, if that makes any sense. Um... So yeah, I'm trying to get all the exteriors out this week. So I have like three, I think. And then next week, I'm going to try to do mostly interiors. I do have an interior that I did a while ago that I, I don't, I didn't have the, I lost the actual build itself. So I didn't upload the, 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 the exterior, the interior. Um, but I'm going to do it anyways, because I love the way it came out and it was a no CC build and I was super happy with it. So that'll be uploaded tomorrow. Today is this, and then I'll be furnishing this sometime next week. I'm trying to make a schedule now. Um, and again, I've been really slacking. Like, I just, some days, like, honestly, I've been so addicted to this Turkish drama. It's not funny. Like, it's two hours long per episode. I'm on episode 11. I can't help it. Like, I was supposed to upload this yesterday, but, like, it was, it was so drama-filled. I'm telling y'all. Like, I, I've watched Turkish, like, I've watched what? I watched three Turkish, two, two Turkish dramas before I watched this one. And this is hands down my favorite one. It is funny. Um, the leads have such good chemistry. They're so cute. Um, the, the secondary characters are amazing. I ship them too. I'm telling you, go watch it. Um, if you have like, you know, what, 14 hours? <laughs> More than that. Um, if you have, you know, 20 hours, you're ready to spend or you want something to watch, I recommend you watch it. Watch it. Even if you have to watch like half an episode a day, I recommend it. Recommend it. It's so funny. It's called Mr. Wrong. It's a Turkish drama. Um, so yeah, totally go watch it. I'd recommend. I'd highly recommend. Um, but yeah. Anyway, so yeah, I've been, I've been watching that recently, and it's been flipping amazing. Um, <laughs> I can't like I can't put my phone down. I, was, I, I think I had a dream of it last night. I, I'm that addicted to it. Like, I I remember like in the last episode they had a misunderstanding, and I was freaking out because listen, I spent what ten hours, no more than that. I just spent okay. If it was episode nine nine plus i spent 18 hours of my life waiting for these two to get together they finally got together and then they break up you know because of a stupid misunderstanding that i oh my god it was i i was i went to punch something like i waited so long there's like and the thing with these two is there's so much sexual tension which you guys know me i love me some good old sexual tension i feel like when it comes to people and their um their tv shows and their tv couples they kind of lack the sexual tension or this the the build up i feel like it just happens and this one it took so long like there were so many chances i'm just like freaking kiss her already you know but it finally happened and they broke up so right now i'm at the point where they're making up so we'll see what happens then y'all um but in the next thumbnail though they are kissing again so that makes me happy but anyways yeah I, I pretty much have dedicated a lot of my life to that <laughs> to that show like i literally have a permanent butt like a butt like a butt um imprint on my couch because i've just been sitting there watching it for hours straight but anywho um how are y'all doing hope i'm doing great let me talk about the build because i didn't talk about that at all um see if i can flip and find it first uh houses okay what what do we got here we have <clears throat> you 
want my one more chance mm -mm. I never thought I'd find You are that one moment I've always known In my mind No one will ever touch me more doom, doom, doom. I only hope Oh my, where is it? No, I'm trying to panic. Where the heck is this? I I built this. It, it should be on recent. Like I just found this one. Like where the heck is it? Um, am I blind? Am I blind? Oh no! Don't tell me. I lost the thumbnail. <laughs> oh, where is it? <clears throat> My throat. Sorry, just got rusty for a second there. I can't find it. That is a no no. I'll have to find it and upload it then, but, um, yeah, it's a, it's a really cool roofed house. That's why I kind of wanted to build it. Um, I just like the exterior of it. I did go ahead and change the, the color scheme because I didn't have the right brick for it and it was annoying me. So I just changed it up to a wood, a woodsy one. And you know me, I love my, I love my wood accents in my build. So I was super, super happy with it. But right now I really can't find the build I built to like give you all like the synopsis of it on their website but that really sucks um I'll try to find it if I don't find it then I am screwed and you guys will not have a build for today which kind of sucks but um anyways on some good news though guess what y'all are wondering like what I'm pretty sure y'all don't really care but anyways um my squash has grown out which is super exciting as you guys I told you guys before um the one thing that was really scaring me about my policies. <laughs> you know one of those that you just feel it coming? Anyways, but um as I told you guys before, um when I like my garden, uh I had squa I had uh butternut squash and I had them growing and they're really long but they just weren't growing any fruit which scared me um but good news they have two fruits on it which i flipped and freaked out this morning when i saw it because i've been hoping for fruits for so long i was like maybe my things are just not growing maybe there's something wrong with it but they have finally blossomed from some fruit and i really can't believe it honestly i think because yesterday i put some new fertilizer on the plant to help it grow and maybe it went to the soil and it finally was able to produce fruit i actually am making some homemade fertilizer i'm gonna try to i know that um they say potassium is good for um for plants and it promotes growth and hope and i have a bunch of not is it potassium i don't know but anyways i have a bunch of eggshells and i have banana peels and so i crushed them up and i'm going to put them in a water to dilute for a little bit and then i think i'm going to dig up the soil and put a layer of that egg banana peel mixture in the soil to hopefully produce more fruit that's my idea i'll tell you how that goes if i actually end up doing it my only fear is that i'm gonna do it and then pests are gonna come i did have a rat pest before it ate like four of my tomatoes actually it ate a lot of my cherry tomatoes um but that's totally fine I have, I have literally one cherry tomato bush and it's growing like crazy so honestly i didn't really care about the cherry tomatoes but yo where is this house <clears throat> like i've been scrolling forever now and i really can't find it i'm actually getting really worried <laughs> i fully thought i saved it but um anyways back to what i was saying uh yeah everything's going well so far they're sprouting I have two fruits can't believe it my squash are finally here I have two more cucumbers so I have three cucumbers now I think I've a I think I actually have a fourth one coming up but we'll see how that goes honestly my pollinating like I see I've, I've been seeing a lot of more creatures in my garden which makes me happy that means my stuff are being pollinated better so we'll see how that all works out but for now I'm quite kind of happy. I will say though, my peppers are done. I'm quite sad about that. I don't think there's any more left. They're not blossoming any more seeds, or maybe they're focusing on growing one. One of them have no peppers on it. Like I cut off the pepper because I think it was spoiling. Um, and yeah, there's nothing on it right now, so that makes me sad because it was flourishing, and then like we had a really weird weather season for a week, and it just I feel like it killed off everything. But whatever, life goes on. Uh, so yeah, that's what I've been up to. I've been really happy this morning. And then also, shout out to my mother, the queen herself. Uh, she went ahead and she passed her RN test. So she's officially an RN. She's a registered nurse. She's been trying to do that for two years now. I've been with her the whole time. We've been struggling, yo. Uh, I can definitely, the thing is, I can definitely see the 
stress that was on her when she had to take the test and she failed it a few times which really put her down but she never gave up because my mom's not a quitter and she passed it so shout out to my mama very proud of her like we were literally the day because i'm the one who actually uh what happened when she was too nervous to uh open the message to tell her if she failed or not especially because this was her last time she only had like a two-year span to get it done and so literally her two-year span um expired today august the first and um so she and she did it on she did it on thursday so she just like she literally waited to the last minute to get it done and so if she failed this one she knew she'd have to go back to school and redo the test and everything and so it was like it would be a really big bummer for her so we were like really praying that she'd pass it and so when she got the letter or the email if she passed or not she let me read it and literally when i saw the password i cried like when i said, said you have passed i cried literally tears i was like mom you did it you know i, I started crying because um my mom has been through me through with me for so long you know she has she has been there with me through thick and thin when I was going through some um mental issues at school and I had to see counseling and everything she was there for me she understood you know she never judged me for what I had to go through and honestly she's been a rock star for me like my mom is my mom like I love her to death and I and this is something I knew she needed for herself and she wanted for herself and she has sacrificed so so much for me and my brothers that I just wanted this for her and I was just I was so overcome with emotion when she actually um she actually got it so yeah I was it was a great day like I said Friday was amazing because that's when we found out and then Saturday um was pretty good too because I got to chill and watch my Turkish drama and today's amazing too because I finally got my like um I finally got my squash plants and so I can finally have some butternut squash so yeah <clears throat> sorry my voice just got a little rusty there but yeah I'm doing pretty well um Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I really, really, really appreciate it. And of course, I'll talk to y'all in the next one. See y'all then. I'm out. This is Peace by Later. I love y'all. Peace.